Hey all you addicts out there, how you doing? Welcome to another tutorial here from Addicted Fishing. I'm Jordan Kanigi. We're taking a little bit of time out of our day to day to kind of go over some stuff that we've seen a lot of, a lot of bash, a lot of good comments we see on our site about how to handle a wild fish, okay? Sean just landed this beautiful little wild steelhead here that we have. We're gonna show you guys how to take a picture, how to hold on to, how to take care of these beautiful fish so that they swim away unharmed. So, this fish swam, caught with the bead, swam right into the net. Since we've had this fish in our, in our hands, it has been in the water. In some states, in Oregon, uh, it's not so much the same, but in Washington, you are not allowed to take the fish out of the water. It's illegal, it's against the law. So it's very crucial to, to pay attention during this video to learn how to take a correct photo and how to take care of these fish so that you're not breaking any laws. What we have here, the beautiful little wild steelhead. She's resting in our net here, relaxing, waiting for us to let her swim back into the river, but we want to get a photo first. So what we're going to do initially is keep that fish in a nice soft area, whether it's near sand or on grass, nowhere near the rocks. That fish is going to flop around. We do not want it to hit the rocks. So if you can see somewhere on the bank to get a good shot that has a nice safe area for the fish to be, that's what you want to do. So I'm going to set this side of the net down. I'm going to grab her right by the tail here, guys, and I'm going to gently slide my hand up and under her gill plate. So from right here, I'm gonna grab her right under her head, keeping that face of the fish in the water, going a nice angle with the back angled about 10 degrees at me towards the camera, facing the water, breathing the whole time, and this is a legal pose. This fish has never come out of the water, it's still breathing, it's still wet, and it's healthy and ready to go back to the river. What we're gonna do now, we've had her in our hands for a couple minutes here, so we're gonna take her, make sure she's sitting up river into the current, getting a nice breath, getting her energy back, and you see how she's starting to kick. You never want to release the fish before you see the fish's reaction to you holding it like this, trying to kick away. So I'm gonna relax, relax my back hand on the tail, let that fish slowly slide out. And as soon as she wants to go, she's gonna swim back out there. Okay guys and gals, so that's how we take care of these beautiful wild steelhead, okay? Even if you're gonna release a hatchery fish, you wanna do it in the same manner. Keeping that fish's head in the water and keeping it safe the whole time, you guys. If you like this video, be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Like and share it out there. Comment below with what you thought, any input you have or any questions you guys have, we'll get them answered. We'll see you guys out there on the river.